Hi guys, it's Gabby. Today is going to be Vlogmas Day 3. If you guys haven't already seen Vlogmas Day 1 or 2, then I will link them down below. I will also have them in a playlist up on my channel. Today's Vlogmas is going to be trying on my mom's clothes from when she was in her 20s. A few weeks ago, my grandma had come over my house and she had dropped off like a bunch of bags of my mom's old clothes from when she was young. And I basically went through all of the bags and I basically kept everything that I thought was cute, everything that I was going to wear and try on because I'm not going to keep clothes that I don't like so I only picked out the things that I really really liked and I thought that were cute. I have them all here. I'm not going to lie. I have already tried them on. I've actually worn a few pieces. You guys just didn't know that they were my mom's. A few side notes. My mom was really really skinny when she was um, my age and a little bit older. Like literally so skinny. A lot of these things just did not fit me. Most of these jeans actually don't fit me at all but I just wanted to show you guys anyways because I thought that they were really cute. Um, I can get them up but I just can't like close them it's absolutely fine um so I just wanted to show you guys the clothes that I got and picked out and most of these things I am going to be keeping all of the shirts I'm keeping and all of the most of the shorts I'm keeping all of the jeans I will probably sell on my depop so if you're interested in some of these items then definitely let me know because they're great jeans some of them are like Levi's and stuff like that so I'm really sad that they didn't fit me because I would have loved to wear it without further ado let's get right on into this video like I said I have all of the pieces behind me that used to be my mom's I'm gonna give a quick description of each piece but the main part of the video is obviously going to be me trying it on and giving my feedback so I'm just gonna go through the shirts first this black velvet one this is so like 90s and so like vintage and cool I don't know how to explain it but you guys know what I'm talking about like those girls on Pinterest that wear like the velvet suits and I don't know what it is but when I saw this I was like yes I have a vision in mind of a perfect outfit to wear this with um it has a zipper that goes down and a nice collar and it looks really really cute on so I can't wait to show you guys what it looks like this is the first top ignore these pants I have to show you guys them later you'll see them later on in the haul but I just have them on because they go with everything I love it I do not have anything like this it is such a nice material and like I said everything's very fitted because that's just what my mom wore and you can zipper it up all the way to the top or you can have it zippered all the way down which is really cute I do have a super cute outfit in mind to wear with this I have or my mom has pants that have this same material so I thought how cute of an outfit would that be? And yeah, so this is the shirt, just a nice black. And like I said, it's kind of like this velvety material, which is really cool because I don't have anything like it. The second shirt is actually a short sleeves. This is the only short sleeve shirt that I have out of everything. This is just a regular, like a uh, thick black crop top. So the reason why I say it's a crop top is because it is like a smaller shirt. Like I said, my mom was so small, so everything is like an extra small. Not normally the sizes that I would get, but it fits and it looks nice, so that's why I'm keeping this. I already have worn this in the summer. It is so cute, and I could even wear this in the fall with like a cardigan, some jeans. It's super, super thick, like such a great quality, and it is a really, really thick material and just like a black basics. The second shirt, this is the mini black crop top that I was talking about. It's not very much crop toppy, but it is sort of. It has this nice pattern, like the lines going down. And I have worn this already before. Uh, it's funny because it's a very thick material, but you'd more so wear this in the summer. So I'm kind of confused as to where it would wear this. But I mean, it's cute and I do like it. So maybe in the spring to summer transition, I'm not really sure. But it is a nice top. I do like it. It's just black. So, you know, it goes with everything. Third piece is a olive green turtleneck now i do have a lot of the same shirts in this style so i'm going to go through them kind of quickly this is just a regular fitted turtleneck i'm sorry it's like on the hanger weird but you guys will see what it looks like on i think that this is so cute because this is the perfect fall color this green is one of my favorite colors to wear this time of year it's really fitted it's really pretty and i actually wore an outfit with this already this is the first turtleneck of many. This is so iconic because I vividly remember seeing pictures of my mom wearing shirts like this. So this is pretty funny now that it's passed down to me. I really like it because it's just a basic. I mean, it is a nice color. I love this color. It's one of my favorite for fall time. I've actually worn this shirt already, which you guys will see in my fall autumn lookbook. I am doing another one. Yes, I have been doing so many. I really like it. It's very comfortable. Like I said, very small, 
all my mom's clothes is like an extra small <laughs> she's crazy but yeah i do like it it's really cute and just like a simple turtleneck i have the same exact turtleneck in a different color this is like a dark caramel color i love this color i'm really getting into beiges and nudes and browns and stuff like that especially during this fall time i haven't already worn this but i am so excited to wear this because i have a few outfits in mind this is the caramel turtleneck it's very similar to the green one that you guys just saw, but actually, now that I have it on, I'm realizing that it is different. It is a bit shorter than the last one, and the turtleneck is more, like, defined, if that makes sense. And the arms also seem to be a bit looser. Maybe it's not the same exact shirt, but regardless, they are very similar, and how cute is this? I mean, I love the color. I'm getting really into, like beiges and caramel colors and browns and stuff like that especially for the fall time so i really do like this and i have yet to wear it so you guys might see it in a future instagram post this is the third turtleneck that i have in the same exact like material as the last two so we have a green one a caramel one and this like off-white um beige one if you would call it once again a great color to wear this fall and once again i do have an outfit in mind um this is just another tight fitted turtleneck which i love i think they're really really cute now that i have this one on i really do like it it is looser than all of the turtlenecks that we tried on so maybe i was wrong and they're not all the same i kind of just thought that my mom bought the same turtleneck in just a bunch of different colors but maybe she didn't do that I don't know, maybe like turtlenecks were like a big thing back in the day. I'm not really sure. But this one does seem different because it's much looser than all of them. And I think it might be my favorite so far. I mean, how cute is this? I don't have any color like it. It's kind of like grays and like beiges mixed in one. If you guys can see, I'm not really sure how to explain that. But it's really cute and I really like it. I have a few more turtlenecks to show you guys, but these are different, kind of. I kind of put them in shade order, if you guys can kind of see on my um, clothing rack. This one is different because it doesn't have the turtleneck that comes out. This one is just a regular turtleneck that goes up. This one is a little bit shorter. I absolutely love this one. I think this looks like really expensive, but it's really not. I don't even know where this is from. My mom said that most of these clothes are from Express, so that's cool. But yes, I really love this color and this turtleneck style. Wow, I really do love this color. This is such a pretty white. It's not like a pure white. It's kind of like a creamy white, if that makes sense. I'm not really sure how to explain it, but this has actually become one of my favorite colors. You see what I mean? Like, it's not a pure white. It has like a little bit of an off-white tint to it, and I'm here for it. I think it's so pretty. I'm just obsessed with all of my mom's clothes. Maybe I can get more and make another video, but I really do love it, and I actually can't wait to wear it. Maybe like an all-white outfit. Ooh. That would be really, really cute. I guess my mom was like really into turtlenecks at her, at her age. I just think it's funny because whenever I look back on photos, she is always wearing turtlenecks and jeans. So it's kind of cute. But yeah, so this is actually my favorite one out of all of them. Once again, we have another turtleneck, but the difference with this one is it doesn't have the stripes going down. Surprisingly, I don't have a color like this. Like, yes, I have white, but all the white shirts that I have are just like body suits or fluffy shirts. Like, I don't have a shirt in this material. This is just another basic because it is white and it does have a turtleneck. So, but this one's a little bit shorter. So that's cool. This one I actually wore on Thanksgiving. If it's a little see-through, it's because I'm wearing a dark blue bra and I just didn't feel like changing it. I love this color. I think it's really, really pretty. It's kind of similar to the last one, except it doesn't have the stripes going down and it's a bit of a different turtleneck because it's not very um, turtlenecky. It's more just like a, a looser one, if that makes sense, or a tighter one, I should say. And finally, the last turtleneck. I know you guys are probably like, oh my God, another turtleneck. Like I said, my mom was really into these turtlenecks. I don't know, that was her thing. We have this like reddish orange one. Now, I'm not gonna lie, at first I was like eh, I don't really have this color like would I wear this but honestly I think it's pretty I like it and I actually would wear this and I do have an outfit in mind with like dark denim jeans maybe like black or white boots like a scarf that'll be cute it's just like a regular style shirt and I don't have anything like this so that'll be cool to add to my clothing collection this color actually looks amazing on this is not something that I would normally go after but I think it's really really nice 
guys. I love this color and I love it on. It is the shortest crop top out of all of them. So I guess, you know, I don't know what my mother was thinking, but it's cute. I like it. I'm not really sure what I would wear this with. The black looks a bit too Christmassy, so maybe something lighter. I'm not sure, but I love it. Oh, with my dark leather brown leggings. Oh, that would look really, really cute. Now that I'm done showing you guys all of the turtlenecks, I'm going to get into the jeans. Now, like I said, all of these don't fit me. I actually have one pair that do fit me, but they're not here right now. They are a black pair, but my grandma is actually going to make them a little bit bigger because of the, those are the only jeans that fit me the best, but I would have preferred them to be a bit bigger. So she's going to do that for me, but unfortunately they're not here. Are these dark denim jeans. Now I'll try my best to fit into them to show you guys but I it was so sad that these didn't fit me because they are a true denim jean and they are truly just the perfect fit and they flare out at the bottom. These are the first jeans and it's funny because they actually fit and I can't remember which jeans fit and which ones didn't so I guess these do. I don't know, they're very tight, I'm not gonna lie but I might just keep them for like an event or two. I mean, they're freaking cute. Like, how could I not? These are my mother's and she was so thin, but hey, you know what? I'm trying, like, I feel like so in the 90s. Like, I don't know, look at me. Okay, let me stop here, next pair of jeans. The next denim jean that used to be my mother's is this other denim pair, but these are obviously a lot lighter. Oh my God, these are from Express. Now these are called boot cuts jeans five slash six i don't know they do they even do sizes like that anymore but once again a true denim jean and these go straight down so that's amazing and like i said i'm so sad that these do not fit me because they are so amazing and i would have loved to keep them these second jeans are not as successful because i remember when i tried them on for the first time i actually broke the little clasp on it and i can't even get them to zip you guys that's what I'm talking about. Like, these are literally so freaking small. These are not a success, and I will not be selling these on my Depop because clearly they are ruined. But maybe I can donate them or something because, girl, they are just not fitting. The last blue denim jean is this one right here. This uh, jean is different than the last two I showed you guys because... It has a different style front. Look at the bottoms. I've always wanted jeans that like flared out like that. So these are really cute. And it's so funny because like I said, I remember my mom wearing this stuff and like pictures and stuff. So it's really kind of iconic. Jeans are not a success either. They are clearly way too small. There's too many buttons. I'm actually going to be selling these on my Depop because I think they're so cute. And I would keep them honestly if it weren't, you know, super tight. Now we have a cream or like a caramel color jean. It's funny because I actually bought a cream pair of jeans from Boohoo. You would have seen that in my Boohoo haul, but they were obviously significantly lighter than these. They were almost close to white. You guys, look how freaking small that waist is. I mean, I'm like thin, but like I'm not that thin. Like, Jesus Christ, my mom was so thin. I have to try them again and just see if they fit and just like really squeeze into them. Um, but if not, I will be selling these on my Depop. So you guys will definitely see that on there. I'm really upset about these because I really wanted them to fit. I think they are super cute, but girl, I just cannot get them to tie. These are really small for me. I will be selling these on my Depop as well because they are very nice but they just don't fit and i love the color so if anybody's interested check out my depop it'll be on there i like the color but you know shame they don't fit the last pair of jeans that i have that used to be my mother's i keep saying mother like my mom duh i don't say mother Ew, i don't know why i said that i'm so sorry i have these white pair of jeans now i do have a white pair of jeans but they're very skinny so once again it would have been nice to keep these so sad once again they are supposed to be like less fitted like more like looser style look how nice you guys and they have like pockets in the back these were a lot harder to put on because there were no things to grab onto it's solely just like a slide on jean or whatever and yeah these <laughs> these just don't fit a little too short i mean i am five six so i will be selling these on my z pop if anybody is interested i look really silly trying this stuff on but hey these are my mom's clothes this is the point of the video these 
Gotta go, honey. These are great. These are work pants and these fit. So how amazing is that? Because these are obviously not jeans, so they are definitely more stretchy. And the reason why I kept these is because I'm gonna need them at some point in my life. My mom used to work at a bank, so she told me that this is what she would wear all the time. One day I'm gonna have to wear them to like an interview or a job thing or something. Ew, but it's here. These are the pants that I've had on for this entire video. These are like the work ones that I was talking about. I've never worn anything like this and honestly, I really like them. The last three items that I have to show you guys are shorts and skirts. So the first one is a skirt. Now I picked this up because I was like, oh my God, this would be so cute to wear this fall, but it doesn't fit me. Yeah, how cute is this? So if any, any of you want this, I will be selling it on my Depop because it is really, really cute, but it just doesn't fit me. If I were to wear this, I'd wear it with like tall thigh high boots and like a black shirt. So that would be a really cute outfit. Obviously, as you guys can see, this little hook is supposed to attach to this button right here, but it's just way too small. It is super cute though. I love it. For the fall time, I would definitely wear this but it just doesn't fit, so this will be up on my Depop too. The second skirt that I picked out is this one. Now this is more of like a dress skirt, which is also why I kept it, because I was like, I'm probably gonna need this in the future too. But like I said, it doesn't fit me, but this is really cute. I mean, it's just like a nude. So once again, I will be putting this up on my Depop for anybody that might want it. Also wear this to like any dress event. I would wear this, I think it's cute, but it just doesn't fit. This is the skirt. It actually looks really nice from the front and it looks like it fits. But the back girl, it just won't close and I'm not even going to attempt to close that. So this will be up on my Depop as well. It's really cute and I honestly would wear this, but it just doesn't fit and it kind of looks cute with this outfit. And the last pair that I have to show you guys, so these used to be my mom's white denim shorts, my bad, and these fit and they look so cute on, so I can't wait to show you guys in the next clip what they look like on. I mean, how cute. I don't know what happened with these shorts. First of all, I just want to point out that the button is on the opposite side. Usually the buttons are on this side. So I'm really confused as to why it's on the opposite side. And I remember trying these on and getting the zipper up, but like, it's just, I don't have the strength today. So I'm not gonna keep these. These are gonna be up on my Depop as well. They are really cute and I really do like them, but girl, this zipper, I just, I'm, I'm not even gonna try. Okay, you guys, so that is the end of this video. I really hope that you enjoyed Vlogmas Day 3 and me showing you guys and trying all my mom's clothes from when she was in her 20s. This is crazy, this is kind of iconic, and this is actually her idea or my dad's idea to film this video. So I thought that it would be fun to show you guys the type of clothes that my mom used to wear when she was younger and, you know, the style back in the day. I do actually like all of these pieces, but like I said, you guys saw in the videos, um, not everything fits. So like. Like I said, the shirts and everything I will be keeping, the jeans um, I will be selling on my Depop. So if any of you are interested, then definitely go look on there. And yes, I love you guys so much. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below what you thought about it, maybe what your favorite piece was. Subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much and I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas number four. I love you guys. Mwah. Bye.